Welcome to another Jen's Jots. All right, so I've given you a lot of information about networking and scripting, a word that I actually don't care for, but it's a place where we have to start. So I wanna give you a couple of tips about how to get started. One is organize. Organize all the words that you want to use. Use words from the Fascination Advantage, words that maybe I mentioned, and then do a lookup on some synonyms for some of the words that uh, didn't quite resonate with you. Uh, for example, I, there was a word that one of my clients was using called keen, uh, and it was part of her fascination advantage, and we just weren't keen on the word keen, so we found a different word. So find the words and organize all the words, organize the problems and the solutions for the variety of categories, such as your clients, your referral partners, and networking. Um, at networking events. Now, once you've organized, the next step is to memorize. Memorize the phrases that you have put together. Now, one of the things that I found that was good about memorizing is once I had written the phrase is I just simply recorded it in my phone and I listened to it over and over and over. By doing that, you're memorizing the phrasing that you're using, whatever your style is. Next, you will customize it. As you have written it and you start memorizing it, you'll come to understand that maybe there's a word or two that you don't quite like or it doesn't flow very well. And in those cases, that's when you start customizing and switching things up just a little bit. Next is internalize it. Once you've customized it, you can internalize it and it will come off of your, your tongue like nothing, just smooth as can be. And it'll be really, really easy for you to go to a networking event, to talk to clients, um, and use your fascination advantage so that it attracts people. That's what we're trying to do. We're trying to attract people using our genuine and vulnerable self. So that's the first tip I want to give you on how to pull this together. The second is that I wanted to give you an extra little bonus about networking. Um, another strategy that I use quite frequently when I'm networking, um, aside from those that we talked about in the module, is a very simple question to ask people when you run into them. So for example, it would be, hi, I'm Jen, how are you? What do you do for a living? And let's say they're a plumber, and I don't care what they say. I don't care what the answer is, but let's say they're the plumber. Your response is, oh, wonderful. Well, tell me what's going on in your business right now, and how can I help you? Very, very simple question. Um, so respond with positive reinforcement. Oh, that's interesting. Tell me what's a project you're working on in your business, and how can I help you? So I've used a couple different items, but it all gets down to, and how can I help you? How could I best serve you? How could I best help you? How could I connect you? These are very, very, very easy ways um, to get the engagement going. And you're going to surprise people because people are not used to people asking for help. They're used to other people trying to take from them. So I wanted to give you that little tidbit and ask you to use it today. If you're networking today or you meet someone for the first time, not a client, but you meet someone for the first time, well, you know what? What if it is a client? They have a job. They have goals. They have projects and things they're working on. Why not ask them? Hey, it's so great to meet you. So let me ask you, what, tell me what's going on in your business and how can I help you? It might be a connection. It might be a referral, right? It might be some other technical wizardry that you have and they're really frustrated with it. So I just wanted to give you a quick little idea as you're putting this together. This is probably the most daunting part of what we're going to be doing over the next couple of um, weeks, along with my dogs <laughs> in the background. So I look forward to catching you soon.